Welcome back. Let's install Splunk on Windows. And yes, I know I'm using Microsoft Edge here, but that's because this is a clean Windows 10 installation. So we'll simply go to Splunk.com and log in with our account and click on Splunk Enterprise. This time, select the Windows tab and select the appropriate version for your version of Windows and click Download. And we will run the file. And it will run the Windows Splunk installer and I like to go here and click on Customize Options just to make sure it's doing everything I want. So it's going to install it on Program File Splunk, which is fine. And choose the user ID that you want it to run as. Now, if you're in a corporation where you are using domain credentials, be sure to select Domain Account, especially if you have a service account set up specifically for Splunk. But for this lab, I'm just going to use Local System. Click Next. And it's going to ask for a password. And OK, create a start menu shortcut. Click Install. OK, and I like to leave that box checked that says Launch Browser with Splunk Enterprise. So click Finish. And as you can see on the URL, it says localhost 8000. That's because we're on this same box. But if you wanted to access it over a web browser outside of this box, you would just do the IP address or the host name of the box and then colon 8000. So let's log in. And there we go. Splunk installed on Windows. I really appreciate you joining me in this video, and I look forward to seeing you next time.